I got getting on with another disturbing breakdown. Now, if you notice, they take down my channel off YouTube, the one of the 14,000 people, the Mag Be The Truth official. As you can see, they're actually scared of the Mag Be The Truth. No doubt about it. So you understand what they're doing there, people. You got it. They can't stand this truth right here. It's like a thorn in their side. It's disturbing what they got for the masses' destruction. It actually fucking with them. No doubt about it. And I always say this. You know, the people that run in these mind games and these operations and the people, they don't care who know about it for say it's still going to go on. But we're actually doing some kind of damage to them. That's why they have to delete the mag. You don't understand. They mention me even in books. You know, a, a lot of people don't know that, but they have a supposed to be New York bestseller. And it's a dude that supposed to be even doing Netflix series and them things. And they actually do a book and, and mention the mag in it. No doubt about it. But they're not doing it to pump me up or nothing. But they have to mention me in there because, I, like I say, I do do damage to their so-called agendas. No doubt about it. And even though, you know, they're taking down my videos and I'm right here with, the, with some few peoples and Patreons and I still got the podcast going on. I'm hurting what they're putting out. We go get into this right here and I'm going to show you some things why they ate the mag bit of truth as you can see them telling you right here another breakthrough treatment again for cancer. Remember the one that you get from, from all these chemicals that they put on you? In your food, your water, all these things that you tie to. Yes, that's the same cancer they're talking about. Now they have a new breakthrough. They're going to supposedly be killed cancer. I'm going to show you some things why they ate the mag bitter truth. Listen. In a remarkable new discovery, scientists at UC Davis in Sacramento, mm -hmm. California, have identified a kill Listen. switch that can activate the death of cancer cells. Potentially Do you understand what they just say, people? They discover a kill switch that can activate... You supposed to be kill the cell in the cancer, kill the cancer cells in your body. You believe that a kill switch? Take a listen to this right here. Like I tell you, in the destruction time, they're gonna come up with more invention to kill off the damn people. Pay attention. In the way in new cancer treatment, this mm -hmm. is new cancer humongous. Treatment. This listen. is groundbreaking. It happens to be in my backyard, being mm -hmm. a native of Northern California. Listen to them. They're and laughing, and of course, it gotta be California people, Hollywood. You have to understand the land of fallen angels. That's what it is. They're playing with the dumb people right here with their supposed to be cancer treatment. I already tell you, you get cancer. They're the one who actually did it to you with, chem with chemical. They poison your body, your cells with chemical. That's what they call cancer. And now they tell you they find a kill switch that your body already have. Listen. You see Davis, Kelsey Kernstein mm -hmm. has details on this Amazing discovery. Mm -hmm. I mean, how exciting. Listen. Adrian and Margie, this really is a big deal. And I think when you put it into the perspective that 600,000 mm -hmm. Americans this year alone are mm -hmm. projected to die of cancer. You hear that people projected to die and they mentioned six. The six is according. Go back again. Listen. Because like I say, people, it's a design plan to kill off the masses without chemical. So they know exactly how much people they're going to kill every year. Listen. Adrian and Margie, this really is a big deal. And I think when you put it into the perspective that 600,000 Americans yeah, this year alone are projected to die of cancer. Projected I mean, to die of cancer. They know. Like I said, they plant the seed and they're activating it these times. Listen. These implications, these new findings are immense and they have the possibility to revolutionize cancer treatment mm -hmm. as we know Listen. it. However, it's not yet been tested on animals and humans. Uh, but it it not yet been tested on animals or humans. First of all, if you test it on animals, you must gonna use it on animals. <laughs> but they never tested on humans. So how the fuck did they know this is a breakthrough? Supposedly. Remember these people, all these things that they're giving you, if they don't test it physical, they can never tell you what it's gonna do. So what is what kind of testing did they do? What did they do to make them say this is a breakthrough? All dumb shit for the masses. Again. Has been proven successful in How? labs thus far. Eh? And humans. But it has been proven successful in labs thus far. In labs. Always proved successful in labs. And you didn't try it out on nothing. You did never try it out. How can you prove something that you never try out? You prove it in a lab. How? 
There's a human being involved. How did you do this? Did you put a cell? Did you put a cell right there and you put the kill switch and kill the cancer cell? It makes no sense here, people. Listen. Scientists are calling it a potential cancer treatment breakthrough. You get targeted specific. So, uh, hold on. Listen. Hold on before this ugly bastard speak. I don't get it, people. Listen. So if it's a kill switch, how it becomes a treatment? If it's a kill switch, you, put, you hit a switch and you kill it. Okay, so what happened? You have to treat them? Once they mention cancer treatment, people, it's a deadly chemical they're going to put in your body. Yes, I saw what? What a dumb shit for the masses. They're just playing with us again. Killing of those cells that are potentially going to do you harm. Go back. Oh, cancer Listen. treatment breakthrough. You Listen. get targeted specific uh -huh. killing mm -hmm. of those cells wow. that are potentially going to do you harm. The cells are going to do you harm. They can particularly target it and kill it with that supposed be kill switch. Remember when they first come out with the supposed be nanobots? They're trying to tell you that whatever sickness you have, COVID or anything, they can put those bots via injection in your body and it's going to go there. Let medicine on that supposed disease or virus you have or cancer to treat it. So listen, people, what is they telling you right here? It's almost like it's the same damn shit. They're going to plant some bots in your body to fight, to fight diseases and cancer and them things. All fake shit for the masses. Specific killing mm -hmm. of those cells that are potentially yourselves? going to do you harm. Wow. And then the healthy cells are left untouched. Okay, that so t t okay, hold on here, people, because there's something untold here. As far as you living without cells, can't happen, people. It cannot happen. Remember, your cells is everything. That's what make your body work. Your cells is everything. So how could you just talk about a cell killer like that? Oh, we're going to just go in there and kill the cells. The one that's going to cause you harm. When your cells die, people, you're going to die. Do you understand that? You ever see somebody recover from cancer and look healthy? The answer is no. They can't be healthy because they got a lot of dead cells. You lose in your cells. You lose immunity and everything you have to understand that listen it's just ideal researchers ideal? from the uc davis comprehensive cancer center say they've located a so-called kill switch that can they located a kill switch and remember they call that place a cancer center <laughs> what a damn joke listen eliminate cancer cells according to a new study published in the journal cell death and differentiation this is this is listen. pretty this is game. Take a look who we got in the background, people. The devil character right there with one eye showing the Einstein. So, yes, people, whatever they can show you in the background, books and everything, even the character that they portray as smart, if they show him in the background, they also go look smart in a dumb world. Remember, I already told you, the reason why they celebrate that fake character in the background, Einstein as smart, is because you're living in a dumb world. That's why they have to specifically call out one person as smart. Got it? That's why everything they give you is smart. The device is because human being is dumb. 100%. So take a look at this right here. They're portraying that they're smart on you and giving you these killers. Pay attention. Of course, they're smarter than Ginger. you. Dr. Joe Gender, too, Shear Singh, oh, is a senior author of the study Joe and Gender. says a combination of immunotherapy mm -hmm. along with the activation of this new kill switch could revolutionize how doctors treat cancer. Now you see what they're showing? They're supposed to be DNA because you already know as everything they do to your body, destroying your cells, that's what they call DNA. You have to understand that. So your cells getting destroyed with everything they do to you. Any treatment, any injections, this is what it do to your body right there. Go back again. Along with the activation of this new kill switch, mm -hmm. could revolutionize how doctors treat cancer. Activate a sort of one-two punch. Think of like a boxing game. Wow. You can keep boxing a boxing wow. person. Don't tell me it's a smart person, people. And you don't understand. This is how I figure out a lot of dumb people here. Because they always want to have debate and conversation with me. And every time we're having a conversation with these dumb peoples, they always have some dumb analogy. <laughs> That's how you figure them out. The analogy is far, far, far from what they're talking about. 
We're talking about cancer and kill switch and you're talking about boxer? Boxing? Like I tell you people, this is how you discover dumb people that play smart. They always have to bring up dumb analogy to basically explain some serious shit. Treat cancer, a sort of one-two punch. <laughs> one like two a boxing punch. game. Mm-hmm. You can keep boxing a box a person on their uh-huh. belly, you know, uh-huh. it'll take forever to el- eliminate the opponent. Uh-huh. But you can make a right punch at right place, you uh-huh. can really eliminate it. So what's, you see people, there go your point right there. Did you understand it? He put it in a boxing analogy. If you're getting punch, punch in the belly, you're not going to get knocked out until you get hit in the head or in the face. What that got to do with this supposed be kill switch that you have in your body that they tell you they're going to activate to kill cancer? It's another stupid shit. Another way to destroy the masses. Like I said, the medical industry. That's the reason why they use the serpents as a logo. Again. Two share saying says his team found a certain receptor that <laughs> they believe can send a signal that causes cancer cells to self What kind of signal? You're talking about send signal the human being body? What kind of dumb shit is that people? Send signal? Go back again. Listen. Dr. Tushir Singh says Tushir. his team found a certain receptor that they believe can send a signal that causes cancer. Why did you mention a certain? And you is a real doctor. Why can't you explain what the hell is your fine? Why is it gotta be certain? Just like that other one gotta use boxing analogy to explain medicine and treatments is bullshit. Wake your ass up with a bam. self-destruct. However, the new research comes with its shortfalls and limitations. Mm -hmm. There aren't enough clinical trials, and thus far it's shown to be most effective in treating liquid cancers, not tumors. Go back. And thus far it's shown to be most effective in treating liquid cancers, not tumors. Liquid cancers? This is some bullshit about liquid cancer. I thought you said it's gonna kill the fucking cells. You never mentioned that the cancer gonna die really, just a cell. So you said the cell, the cancer get... The cell, the cell get controlled by the cancer then and take it over. And you're going to kill the cell. So when you kill the cell, you kill the cancer. But you're not after the cancer. The kill switch that they're talking about that they're going to find in your body. It's not going to kill cancer. It kill your cells. So they're saying when the cancer get on the cell, they can activate the kill switch and kill the cells. So hear me, people. Just like I always mention about the chemotherapy. Remember the chemo, the, 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 the chemical that they're putting in your body to kill cancer. Remember, it don't kill cancer. Nobody know that? No, it kills cells. So you understand what I'm saying? When I tell you about cancer, I never miss. That's why they hate the bitter truth. I'm not a doctor. I'm just using common sense. You understand that? So hear me. The treatment for cancer don't kill cancer. Okay. So what does it do? It kills cells. That's the same thing the chemotherapy do. So this supposed to be kill switch that they can activate it. It only kills cells. So they open now supposedly they're telling you that when we activate this kill switch, yes, the cancer on that, on that cell, we're going to kill that cell with the cancer and everything in it dead. That's what they're telling you. So listen, people, they're never going to come up with this supposed be cure for cancer. Only cell killers. And listen, when your cell die, you die. What I say? There's a reason why you can't live with the cancer on your cells. Because you, your cells is what holding your body up and this, this chemical take it over. So it can't get to function. It doing different things, giving you reaction. That's what they call cancer. So listen, people. The cell is not there. It's not going to be good. So these people coming up with new ways how to kill off the human being cells right there. So listen to me, people. That's why I tell you, if I, if I ever get in a situation, because I won't get up and just go to the doctor to go check if I got cancer. It's dumb shit. So say, for instance, something happens to me and, you know, my, 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 my people or my loved ones get me to the, the hospital or the doctor or whatever. And they say, listen, man, I got cancer. Once I got any kind of control, people, once I can move, I would leave. I would never stay there to get this supposed be treatment. You tell me I have cancer. Yeah, thank you. I'm good. Thanks for the heads up. When I'm gone. This is just my personal feeling. This is how I feel. So that means they can never kill my cells. 
So yes, you could go to the doctor and he tell you you have cancer. Just so they can work the operation of killing your cells. Or you're going to tell them, no, there's something come up on your body. Here. They say, oh, a little pimple come up. And they say, yeah, look at this. We're going to do a biopsy and they take it to the lab or whatever. And they come back and tell you, listen, you have a cancer and it's stage four or stage something close to death. What you're going to do? They say, oh, we got to start treatment right away. This is how they do it. It's not like you go there sick, but you have a so-called bump or something. You know that the food trigger off and these poison that you take in trigger off and then bam, they have you in their hands to kill your cells. That's what they do, people. They're after the masses cells. That's what keep you alive. Some people even selling their people's their white blood cells. They give them a little cash just to take that. Unbelievable. When I mention now with the weight loss drugs that they got on the table, killing your fat cells, that cells you're losing, people. When you lose your cells, you get weak, your body dying. You have to understand that that's why the cancer is dangerous because it goes for the vital part of your body, your cells, and destroy it. So don't let them treat you with, with cell killers. That's the reason why you're taking it because your cells in dire up situation and now you let them give you a treatment to kill those cells. Unbelievable. Are generally those cancers that are bloodborne cancers. So blood things born. like leukemia, oh. where the cells are loose and circulating, and so oh. not a solid what? tumor. Solid tumors oh. are like uh, lung cancers uh -huh. or ovarian cancers. Or All of them come from the same thing, people. Deadly synthetic chemical made by the government people. That's it, people. You can't even deny it now. It's too much. They come out and tell you the forever chemical is the leading cause of cancer, but it's not something that you got in your body just develop. It's something that they made synthetic chemical. They can't hide it no more, people. The fucking, the, everything is out. The cat is out the bag. Deadly chemical created by man give you cancer. Don't ask again. It's over now. There is no use even think about it. It's done. That's exactly what happened right there. They feed you these deadly synthetic chemicals made by man, destroying your body, causing complications, things that you can never re reverse with naturality. You can't use naturality to reverse none of it because it was created by synthetic chemical, take over your body and kill you. And I told you that's the reason why we are on this side of the earth. We can't live too long. The harvest in soul. You have to die to let the other person live. 100% in. Yes, another mag. Bam. I'm gone.